welcome or welcome back to my channel. We've been here for hours and we're finally gonna go home, um, I think. But we might be stuck in traffic because it is rush time and we decided to go home now. I don't know why I'm wearing these rings. <laughs> so Penny's, I heard it was three floors, but I guess it's only two floors because we didn't see a third floor, but it was quite big. Anyway, um, so hi all. Actually, yeah, hello all. <laughs> Um, so I just did a Timu um, unboxing video trying Timu for the first time so if you want to see that that video will probably be out before this vlog so my video should already be up on my channel um, and basically we went to the shopping center the Dundrum shopping center and it's like one of the fanciest shopping centers I'd say in Ireland and um, they have very fancy stores and stuff like that um, <clears throat> But it's kind of far away from home, so we don't normally go there. 
but yeah we bought a few things i might do a quick haul we were there for hours and the parking was 9.50 nine euro and fifty cents for parking which is quite crazy to be honest because some other shopping centers like the parking is free um or it's like cheap but yeah it's 950 so that's fun um i got two starbucks copies which is already over 10 euros like 11 euro or no even more than that for two starbucks copies <sighs> grandes um We walked around we had some lunch we had some sombrero uh, my fiance had some ramen i um, might do a quick haul of everything that i got to be honest again i was picking up random things that i don't really even need but i saw them and i was like they're cute <laughs> so i might do a quick haul on that the weather is finally nice um we're actually on holidays for 10 days um for my birthday so my birthday is on monday so today is actually wednesday um the week before but we couldn't take next week off because there's a lot of people on holidays so you know what whatever we were both exhausted so we were like let's just take holidays now but we will be going on a weekend trip so i will hopefully vlog hopefully the weather is nice because all week it's supposed to be raining and it has been but today it's actually really nice so hopefully we'll stay this way because we don't want to travel <coughs> in horrible weather i made a new channel a youtube channel purely for basically hotel room tours and more like travel videos regarding like tours and reviews about hotels and places to stay and stuff like that so um if you want to follow me there it's travel queen i believe i will try to link it in my description if i remember and basically there you're just gonna see hotel room tours and reviews of hotels and stuff like that or like travel destination reviews whereas here i'm gonna try and keep more like sit down videos and vlog style videos sit down videos and vlog style videos because i've noticed like every time i'm vlogging when I'm away, I always do a room tour and I'm like, this is probably boring for you. And if it's not boring for you, I can obviously, I will upload it to my Travel Queen YouTube page for the tours. But anyway, yeah, we're on the way home, but I might do a quick haul while my fiance is driving. So I'm just gonna grab random. Pretty sure the Minnie Mouse um, collections are being discounted because they came out with the new Barbie range because the Barbie movie is coming out and they still have the Stitch range for the longest time ever but and they have a small Bratz range as well but I think the Minnie Mouse range has gone out of style in pennies or what's the word not out of style but out of season I don't know anyway I got this makeup brush set and honestly i don't know what i do with my brushes i used to have so many of them and i keep losing them um and i think it's purely because i don't do my makeup often enough that like i just literally make my brushes disappear if i use them i will throw them in my, in, in my little makeup bag and then <laughs> i don't know what i do with them to be honest but it's just a set of five brushes and they will come in handy um and they have like mini mouse at the bottom so yeah just a simple set powder brush angled foundation brush eyeshadow blending brush precision eyeshadow brush eye and brow brush so they'll come in handy then they had basically the same version of these except it said barbie on it and it was instead of these ones were eight euro and by the way actually this is five euro from nine euro so i got discounted to five euro and these are eight euro and the barbie ones are 11 and i was like you know what i really don't care if it says barbie or not and i'm like i don't know like i don't care but um i was gonna wear these um, i was gonna wear these like at home anyway like if i'm gardening or like whatever i need to go outside um these will be handy to wear outside because 
because I don't really have outdoor slippers so I keep going out with my indoor slippers going outside and then going back in the house and obviously that just makes floors dirty like indoor slippers are indoor slippers for a reason so I got these ones they had a few colors like they had black and blue I think and white but I just got pink um, then like always I always grab like the cluster lash cluster lashes it's 650 for this um, and it's 150 individual lashes assorted sizes and I absolutely love these it says individual lashes but they're actually clusters of three so they're actually clustered lashes but I absolutely love these I get compliments and people think I got my eyelashes done like professionally when I'm literally just sticking these on and normally the glue lasts me for a minimum of a week um, unless like I have a very good sleep that I like rub my eyes or whatever or if I'm crying or something like that then it will fall off from the corners but other than that like they last so long I wore these in Gran Canaria last year oh god I can't see and they lasted me the whole holiday how long were we there? It didn't fall off and I was swimming and sweating and everything and they stayed on the whole time so I was so happy then I just got a bra like just a regular bra that was five euro and then I got a hoodie a zipper zip up hoodie in this color because honestly like sometimes I look for a hoodie just to throw on when I'm cold or when it's windy or whatever and I can't find one and I have like a flat one I know uh, somewhere and I have like a light grey one somewhere and that's about it and maybe like I don't know I just thought I would get a hoodie so I got a big baggy one and in the vlog I showed you my Lush um, what I got from Lush and it smells amazing so I got a Lush um, bubble bar, I don't know what it's called, I wonder if it's going to tell me in a receipt. And also a bath bomb that's literally, I don't know if it's true or not, but it says Lush CBD on it. And then it says 420 on the other side, which you can't really even see. But anyway. like CB relaxes you um, so when I'm having my bath maybe it's gonna relax me I don't know um, and can you believe it I don't think I've ever tried Lush before maybe I got a bath bomb once maybe like a long time ago but yeah okay so it's called the comforter bubble bar which is 850 and then the 420 CBD bath bomb which was 9 euro so I paid $17.50 just for those two, which is a bit insane, but we're going to be going to the hotel and hopefully it's going to have a bath because not all hotels have baths. Um, so hopefully we'll have a bath so I can use them because I don't have a bath in my home. And then I'm so excited about this one. I seen it and I was like, I have to get it. Like, I don't care. But it's a Costa travel cup and how cute is it? It's beautiful. Costa coffee and it's like turquoise and it has these like white swirls. And it opens up like that. And the only annoying part is this top is like a silicone material so all the dust like sticks to it. But yeah and it's hand wash only really because I spent so much money on coffee it's actually not even funny like at all like it's kind of embarrassing the amount of money I spent on coffee when I can make it at home I brought uh, I bought a brand new coffee machine and like I've been using it for like a month or two and then kind of just stopped and started buying coffee again but yeah very cute that cup was 1850 but hopefully it will save me from buying coffees 
all the time. I got these shoes for work. Now, they honestly... They honestly are not really my style. And when I look at people wearing them, I'm like, eh, I don't really like it. However, I do think it would look nice with a blazer um, in work or when you're going to a more professional setting. Um, I got these shoes and honestly, I think they're called loafers. I'm not really a big fan of them. They're just not really my style, but they're not bad and maybe they will look nice on so I got these in size 4 and they were 15 euro we'll see like they look okay especially that it's summer I don't want to be wearing like um, boots uh, and then my fiance got some swimming shorts for the holiday so they're like a balayage um, gray blue and white they were 7 euro then he just got a t-shirt for 3 euro and 50 cents I don't even know what it says but it's nice then I got a pair of leggings and honestly you will probably not meet a person that has more leggings than me but I always want to be safe and like have a pair of leggings handy because like I don't know when I have nothing where I just throw leggings on and I'm good to go. So honestly, I have like 30, I have like 30 or 40 pairs of leggings. Um, then I just got a black tank top, literally. That was I don't know, three euro. Then I got these shoes. So they're the high top ones white and black in size 5 and I don't know what price they are because there was no price tag but I think they count they scan in as 11 11 something the receipt is probably in the other bag but they scanned in 11 something I think and then I got a sleeping night shirt which is very long but it has stitch on it with a pineapple <laughs> and that was 9 euro and then also stitch beauty blender with holder so that's the holder and that's the beauty blender but it looked so cute and it was only 3 euro instead of 5 and I think that's it very warm today. It says it's 21 degrees. Okay, so I actually never talked about my um, pennies experience. So the new pennies, I think I actually kind of talked about it, but not a lot. So basically they had a lot of self checkouts so you know the ones that you go and scan the products yourself and then you pay yourself like self-service like checkout they had a lot of them in pennies which is i guess it's good because there used to be so many cashiers and the queues were still crazy so now they have like a lot of self-service and then just a couple of cashiers so that's cool and we tried the self-service checkout and it was interesting um two products had issues on them so in, in pennies a lot of times something does not scan or something is wrong or there's no tag or whatever it is so i don't know how that's gonna work but one of the shoes didn't have the tag on them and you can't enter the code you have to scan it so I, we had to call for help and then another thing was priced wrong so it was scanning in as a completely different price so we had to ask for help as well um but anyway it was weird um also there was a big screen that was literally filming everything that you were doing so i don't know how i feel about that like obviously there's cameras in the whole store they kind of watch it anyway but it was like filming my face the whole time when i was scanning everything which i don't know how i feel about that to be honest um maybe just to have you on footage in case 
something happens or something gets lost i don't know or not lost but like something gets stolen or whatever um and then number two you cannot leave the self-checkouts until you scan your receipt so if you don't scan your receipt you cannot leave um which was quite interesting i've seen a lot more stores do this like a lot more stores have like you have to scan your receipt to leave like what if you're not buying anything and you're leaving you know what I mean? well in pennies it's different it's nowhere near the exits but like in other stores that i've seen it's like you can't leave I don't know if you don't buy anything it's weird um i don't know what i'm talking about <laughs> anyway we have this neighbor's cat basically that was very cute it took a few days to kind of get the cat close because the cat was scared didn't want to come near us and stuff like that and then we kind of created a good relationship with the cat the cat is very cute it comes to us all the time and it's not afraid of us anymore and it constantly wants to come into our house but to be honest i don't really want that because there's cat hair everywhere then and i have allergies so yeah but anyway um i was in the sitting room or living room with my fiance and i we saw the cat outside kind of like far away and i was like oh hey kitty come here kitty or whatever it was and like the cat heard us and literally jumped straight up to the window to say hi and i opened the window to pet the cat and i was petting the cat and the, the cat kept trying to get inside the house and i really was not feeling it because it's evening time we're gonna go to bed soon i just didn't, didn't want the cat in the house and i kept kind of like eat very 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 nicely pushing it away so it doesn't like jump into our sitting room like it stays outside and i was pushing the cat away but very gently and the cat literally like hit me and scratched my arm so yeah my arm is a little bit bleeding so my anxiety tells me that i'm gonna get an infection because i've heard someone getting an infection before but like it's the tiniest little two little cuts ever so i'm sure i'm fine i'm just kind of like panicky about that and honestly i think we're gonna stay away from that cat from now on because that was not nice like and it could have got worse like it could have scratched me way worse or it could have jumped in the house and attacked me like i don't know um so i think we're gonna kind of stay away from the cat from now on but yeah now i have two scratches on my arm that are bleeding a little bit so that's fun but it's night time so we might play like a game or two of fortnite and then go to bed tomorrow's thursday and then on friday we're gonna go to the hotel so i'll take you with us but yeah maybe i'll see you tomorrow mm -hmm.